<laughs> you guys have a present. Can we open it? Check the card first. What does it say? It's my present from Mickey and Jordan. From who hears your prayers, Merry Christmas. Why don't you lift up the box? Do you miss Daddy? Yeah. Are you glad to see him home? Yeah. Have a kiss. <laughs> Thank <Yeah>. you. Ew. <laughs> Everybody say bye. Bye. Today is Sergeant Major Mike Letterly's first day back home, a day he's been planning for months. So when we found out the mission was going to end early, uh, my wife and I decided not to tell the kids, just in uh, off chance we could surprise them at the end. And what a surprise it was today at Southern Boone High School. I am so overwhelmed and so shocked, but I am super excited to have him home. For now, the Letterlies will go home and do one of their favorite things. Um, probably watch a movie. And they'll do it as a family again. Oh, and Dad has one last thing to say. Samantha and Trenton, Mom and Dad got you. Mike DeFranco, KRCG 13 News, Ashland. You got sprung early on a long weekend. <laughs> <laughs>
really in you. It was mission accomplished for this soldier. His son had not seen him for an entire year. A flood of emotions, uh, excited, nervous, uh, hoping his reaction was, was good. 105th graders filled the gym at Scottville's Upper Elementary School. They all thought they were coming to an assembly to hear me talk about my job as a reporter, a cover-up for something much more special. The tear ducts working, the chest tightening up just to see that because I knew the excitement for Brandon and what that meant to him was just the world. The idea for this big reveal came over the weekend when Brandon found out his dad would not be coming home on a bus with other soldiers. Brandon was devastated. The devastation quickly turned to joy thanks to teachers, family, and friends. I jumped up and hugged him. Hi, buddy. Uh, are you surprised? And he agreed, yeah. He said, yeah, he was surprised. He was pretty choked up. An emotional moment for this little boy. A relief to see his father, his hero, home safe and sound. In Mason County, Lord Amstead's 7 and 4 News.